sentence that the judge actually mentioned in his judgment was Section 18 of the Peaceful Assembly Act, which is mm. what we have been seeing. Yes. Ms. Maria has been talking about. We've all been talking about. And he recognised that that is an option for the police to take, mm. uh, or, or the judgment certainly seems mm. to, uh, to to say that, suggest that. And in fact, interestingly, um, the uh, red shirt, uh, the the council for the red shirts actually said that uh, if the police directed them to do to do their rally in another place, they would consider it. Mm. So in that case, I think. Uh, it, it would be very wise for the police to actually <laughs> take them up on that. Yeah. And, and mm. the, another thing the judge said is that Section 18 is actually a safety valve yeah. uh, mm. to diffuse That's right. uh, the situation if there is any uh, possibility of yes, a, right. any conflict. <coughs> so that is a very useful pronouncement by this court on Section, Section 18. 18. I, I believe it's the first time that a court has considered first Section 18. And it gives the, it reminds the police actually of a power that they already have. So all this concern by various bodies that you know is going to give a that is going to result in clash and so on and so forth, uh, even by people in very high authority, you know, right up to today, is actually uh, actually not the case because the police have ample powers. Section 18 is very clear, as Ambiga has mentioned, to diffuse the situation, and the court has recognised this. And we hope now the authorities will begin to act on this provision because it is a very clear provision.